Hi guys, this is Anjali here. In this tutorial, I am going to teach you about file handling. So, why file handling is required? File handling is an important part of any app web application. You often need to open and process a file for a different task. PHP has several functions for creating, reading, uploading and editing files. When you are manipulating files, you must be very careful. You can do a lot of damage if you do something wrong. Common errors are editing the wrong file, filling a hard drive with garbage data and deleting the content of a file by accident. Now let's start with our first function which is read file function. So what read file function do? Read a file function reads a file and write it to the output buffer. So let's start with an example writing in PHP tag giving a heading for better understanding PHP read file function now echo syntax for read file function is read file round bracket double quote file name our file name is information dot txt semicolon is required I already create information.txt so let's take a look at output localhost slash tutorial is my folder name then php and file handling dot php you can see that read file function reads all the data from information.txt so that's all for read file function our next function is f open function I created different file for that starting PHP tag giving an heading for better understanding as to in this file we will understand f open f read and f close function so giving an heading for that PHP file f open f read and f close function first function is f open function a better method to open file is with f open function this function gives you more option than the read file function so here I am declaring one variable dollar file then f open syntax for that is file name or file name is information dot txt and mode which specify which mode you want I am here uh, writing uh, read mode which specifies with r or die unable to open the file now next step is read file so for that use fread function syntax for that is handle which means the variable that holds our file then length for length I am using file size function and in that our file name is information dot txt now after read we need to close the file so for that I am using f close function and which holds the variable in which our file is stored so let's take a look at output f open dot php you can see that f open open the file name information dot txt f read the data from it and f close function will close the file our next function is f gets function so let's start php giving in heading read single 
line f gets function now what f gets function do the f gets function is used to read a single line from a file i am copying the same code from the previous file copying the same code writing here and instead of f read just write f gets and which holds the variable in which our file is stored so let's take a look at output f gets function you can see that f gets function only uh, read the first line of information dot txt so that's all for f gets function our next function is f e o f function now what f e o f function do f e o f function check if the end of uh, the uh, file has been reached the f e o f function is useful for looping through the data for unknown length so let's take a look with an example starting php tag ending it giving an heading check end of file f e o f function now again declaring a variable dollar file f open information dot txt mode is r which specify read file or die unable to open the file now output one line until end of the file so through the loop i am using here while loop while not f o f e o f dollar file echo f gets dollar file using br tag and f close will close the file let's take a look at output e f e o f you can see that f e o f function read single line first then uh, after reading first line it will read second line and after reading second line it will read third line so it will check line by line that's all for f e o f function our next and last function is f get c function so what f get c function do the f get c function is used to read a single character from a file i am copying the same code from the f e o f function file pasting it here and instead of f gets function i am writing f get c function which will read a file by character so let's take a look at output f get c function dot php you can see that f get c function read the file by single character so this is the output for f get c function here instead of this heading 
we need to write read single character f get c function so this is output for f get c function so that's all for file handling tutorial thank you for watching this video